In 1947, a United States Congressional Committee which includes Prim Phoebe Frost of Iowa arrives in post-World War II Berlin to visit the American troops stationed there. Phoebe hears rumors that cabaret torch singer Erika von Schluto, suspected of being the former mistress of either Hermann Göring or Joseph Goebbels, is being protected by an unidentified American officer. She enlists Captain John Pringle, another Iowan, to assist in her investigation, unaware that he is Erika's current lover. After seeing Erika with Adolf Hitler in a newsreel filmed during the war, Phoebe asks John to take her to Army headquarters after hours to retrieve the singer's official file. In order to distract her, John woos Phoebe who initially resists his romantic advances but eventually succumbs to his charms Colonel Rufus J. Plummer advises John he is aware of his relationship with Erica and orders him to continue seeing her in the hope she will lead them to another of her ex-lovers. Ex-Gestapo agent Hans Otto Bergel, believed to be hiding in the American occupation zone. Meanwhile, Erica and Phoebe are arrested during a raid designed to catch Germans without proper identification. Papers at the Lorelei, the nightclub where Erica performs at the police station. Erica claims Phoebe is her cousin in order to secure her release without revealing her identity. Phoebe, grateful for Erica's intercession on her behalf, goes with her to her apartment where Erica confesses that John is her lover just before he arrives. Humiliated, Phoebe leaves. Later, at the military airport waiting for the fog to clear, Colonel Plummer attempts to reconcile Phoebe and John. John is targeted by a jealous and armed Burgle at the Lorelei. But Burgle is killed by American soldiers who shoot him first. Erica is arrested for her complicity with Burgle, and Phoebe and John are reunited.